How is it going guys? Thanks a lot for joining me for another beer review. Today I'm going to be looking at a beer I picked up at a Pure Project out in Miramar, California when I was uh, visiting a couple months back. And uh, yeah, picked up this beer along with a few of their IPAs and stuff. Uh, reviewed one of them for the channel. Really, really good brewery. So super excited to try this one out. This is uh, in collaboration with uh, Abnormal Beer Co. A uh, little north of San Diego, I believe. But uh, yeah, this is Carpe Noctum. And uh, bourbon barrel aged imperial stout coming in at 11.5% alcohol by volume, 40 IBUs. They're using uh, maple syrup, cacao nibs, and hazelnuts in this beer. So it sounds freaking delicious. One thing I gotta say about this beer is it was uh, pretty damn pricey. Uh, $17 American per can, which is usually more than I'd uh, spend on a beer. But um, you know what, this sounded good and I was on vacation so I figured why not. But uh, without further ado, let's get Carpe Noctum poured and give it a review. Alright, got Carpe Noctum poured and it pours light motor oil. Hitch black body, nothing's coming through there. No light whatsoever. A uh, finger of a really deep brown, almost like a caramel brown kind of head. Really beautiful looking beer. A bit of alcohol legs when you swirl the glass. Um, yeah, looks really nice. Let's get an aroma. That smells so good. Maple syrup right away on the aroma. Tons and tons of maple syrup. Getting a little bit of a nuttiness. I don't know if that's a hazelnut per se. Yeah, there's a definite nuttiness in it. Tons of chocolate in this beer. There's some of that bourbon in the background too. Some roastiness. A tinge of like a whiskey kind of booziness as well. But yeah, that's super chocolatey, super maple syrup forward. This smells awesome. Let's try it out. Cheers. That is a pretty hot beer. <laughs> Definite booziness to the beer right away, it's like a whiskey kind of booziness, like a aged uh, bourbon, something like that. Um, there's a definite warmth across the tongue, but not really a burn or anything down the esophagus as some bourbon barrel aged imperial stouts can be, um, especially in the uh, 10 plus range, you know. Um, really nice, uh, well balanced kind of boozy characters. You get some vanilla, um, some oaky, some uh, caramel kind of notes from that. Uh, barrel. Yeah, big oaky kind of a char kind of thing going on. Yeah, nice roastiness to the beer. Tons of chocolate, like a milk chocolate, a really bitter dark chocolate kind of thing going on in this beer. Um, yeah, really nice. Uh, the maple syrup, it's there, but it's not super predominant, not like it was in the nose. I'm kind of missing that, but uh, I got maple syrup upstairs, so I might pour a little bit in. Who knows? Um, hazelnut, I typically wouldn't say there was hazelnut in there. There is a nuttiness, but uh, I've had a few hazelnuts uh, over the last week. But other than that, I wouldn't really specify what kind of nuttiness it was. Like a hint of vanilla in there as well. Like a Mexican vanilla, it's got this really nice... Uh, uh, like a sharp vanilla kind of taste in the background there. Really cool. Mouthfeel is, uh, it's got a nice syrupy, like, lip coating, kind of lip smacking kind of syrupiness to it. I could use maybe a little bit more carbonation, but uh, it's really nice. It's got this denseness, this uh, smoothness, uh, this, like, really soothing kind of silky smooth imperial stout kind of mouthfeel, you know. Uh, medium, medium plus kind of body. Really cool. As a rating, I think I'd go like straight up 90 on this beer. Um, I've got another can um, in the cellar, and I think I'm going to age that a few more uh, months, see how it turns out. Um, maybe the booziness uh, dies down a little bit, maybe it mellows out a little bit. But uh, as it stands, straight up 90, A- minus kind, kind of rating. It's really damn good. Let me know what y'all think of Carpe Noctum, any of either brewery's other beers. Uh, thanks for watching, uh, till the next time, cheers, and, uh, seize the night.